Hello everybody and welcome back to World of Warships. But not World of Warships Legends, no. No, this is World of Warships PC. That's right, we are officially invading World of Warships PC today. Now, I'm gonna be 100% with y'all, all right? I have not played this game on PC in years. And when I played previously, I was a potato. So have I improved? Has my time with World of Warships Legends on console made me a better player? Or am I still a tater? But I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Well, Spartan, how much of a tater were you? Go ahead. If you were such a potato, let's see your stats. All right, all right, I see you. I see you guys. You guys want to see my stats? There you go. This is a potato. Look at this, 112 total battles played, three people killed. <laughs> Friggin' hell. 47% win rate. Absolutely carried by everybody to a 47%. Like, this is awful. Awful! I don't know why it says three warships destroyed here, but it also says 43 here. So, I, I maybe not as... I'm still a potato, don't get me wrong. But it says I've killed four, 43 warships, 36 by main guns, so that makes more sense, right? Um, now, again... We know what I'm best at, right? I am not the best torpedo boat. I am not the best... I hate aircraft carriers, so just stop right there. That's not going to be a thing. Uh, cruisers, probably not my biggest thing. So we are going to be playing... Battleships. And not just any battleships, American battleships to start. Uh, now, you guys may be saying, Well, Spartan, how do you already have the New York? Well, as you just saw, I have played this game before. And this is where I left off. Now, the last time I played my New York, I went to the right side of the map. I dodged all but one torpedo and got detonated by that single torpedo. And then I uninstalled the game and said, if this game ever comes to console, I would love to play this game on console against people that I can actually learn to play against because I have no idea what I'm doing. And now we've, we've done that. So let's see if I can actually get in. Now, I got five days of premium given to me when I logged in, um, and I'm looking forward to this. I'm not going to lie. I'm looking forward to actually testing this out. Now, I don't know anything about this game. I, I, I really don't. Like, we need to get our commander. We got a level eight commander here, so we need to figure out what we got. We've got... Uh, this reduces swell, or shell switch time. Uh, this gives us more HE damage, which is definitely not going to be a thing. Uh, let's see. Consumables. We got fighter consumable reload. Defensive fire main battery reload booster consumable reload. I don't even think we have any of that. Uh, emergency repair specialist probably wouldn't be a bad idea. It gives us a uh, better reload party or repair party consumable reload time, reload time of the damage control party as well. What else we got? Incoming fire. I'm just going to assume. Hey, the good news is nobody will know me on PC, right? Like, that's the good news. So I'm going to get to fly under the radar. Uh, preventative maintenance reduces the risk of main turrets, uh, torpedo, steering gears, and engine becoming incapacitated. So I think we're going to go with emergency repair specialist. What do we got here? We got uh, grease the gears, gives us better traverse speed. We've got inertial fuse for HE shells. Uh, again, don't think that's going to be a thing because I'm going to be firing AP more often than not. Increases ship speed while she remains undetected. Interesting. Extends the torpedo acquisition range even while hydroacoustic search consumable is active. Interesting. Priority target. This detection indicator additionally shows the number of opponents on the enemy team that are currently aiming at your ship. Okay. And AA defense and ASW expert. So that gives us... Airstrike depth charge... Better AA. And depth charges. Oh yeah, that's right. Submarines are a thing in this game. <laughs> I'm gonna get so pwned. Let's be real. Like, I got no idea what I'm doing. I'm terrible on keyboard and mouse too, so this is gonna be great. It's gonna be awesome. Uh...
Like, I honestly just don't think we have... I, do we even have airstrike depth charges on a, a New York? Like, I feel like that ain't a thing. Continuous AA is probably a good thing, but at l such a low tier, I don't think it's going to be much of a, a... I mean, we have 35 AA defense. If we select this, what is it actually going to do? So I think in this case, I am either going to go with speed or grease the gears for the extra turret traverse. What's our current maximum speed? 21 knots! Holy crap! PC's already better. Thought we were only capable of 19 on freaking console, good lord. Of course, that's probably due to the fact that we actually have that gyrating drill bit skill, which reduces your overall speed. Alright, so let's take a look. We're going to go super heavy AP, obviously. Gives us main battery AP shell damage. Okay. Long range secondary battery, we don't really care about that. Adrenaline rush. Enhances ship parameters for each 1% one one of hit points lost. That actually wouldn't be a bad skill at all. The more damage you take, the faster your guns get. That's not bad. Uh, basic survivability. Module, fire, and flooding recovery time. Okay. Improved repair party. And focus fire. Priority sector is activated by pressing the zero key while facing in the direction of hostile aircraft. That's pretty cool. Uh, but I think we're going to go with the Super Heavy AP. And then uh, Furious, we've got... Improves the ship's characteristics uh, for each active fire on board your ship. So if we get focused by HE spam, we get better? What is this? Like, that's actually genius. I like that. Imagine if that was on console. I, w I would have, like, the most ridiculous reload of all time. All right, what do we got? Secondary battery, meh. We got close quarters combat increases the reload speed of main battery after an enemy has been spotted within the firing range of your ship's secondary battery. That's not bad. Emergency repair expert. Damage control party. Uh, we get an extra damage control. Okay. And an extra repair party. That's huge. That's actually huge. Uh, concealment, ship detectability range, and then we get uh, fire prevention expert. So I think we're going to go with this. There we go. We have our first commander, Claude Shaw. You're going to be, uh, you're going to be my dude. All right. Let's go back. Let's get into our first match, shall we? God, I... Don't know what I'm doing, but let's do it. Oh god, it's so loud. No skills mastered. This commander has un undistributed skill points. To master skills and increase your commander's efficiency in battle, navigate to the commander's skill screen. Uh, okay. I thought we just did all this. Dag nabbit. Okay, I think we went with repair party... Yeah. And then we went with, um, that, I think. And then we went with, super heavy AP. And we went with that. Um, I 
Not enough undistributed skill points for mastering skills. Oh, so do we not actually get to, uh... Okay, so we can master these. Yes. Beautiful. Now we need what? Okay, so this costs four points. We only have two. So we actually can't do this yet. Okay. I get it. I get it. I'm slow. Give me a break. I'm a console nub. It's what we do. All right. All right, let's go. Uh, we want to change this to random battles because screw co-op. Am I right? Trial by fire, baby. We don't play... Oh, hello. Okay. This reminds me of the old days of World of Tanks console. Uh, at least there are no submarines playing. That's, that's the thing. Maybe... Didn't I hear something about them taking them out temporarily? So that's good. We don't have to worry about that. Uh, but 14 battleships, 6 cruisers, 8 destroyers, 7 aircraft carriers. Sounds fun. Let's go, baby. Players within your range. 40 people. Come on, let's put us in a match then. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy. Oh no. Water. Alright, here we go. I got high hopes, folks. High hopes. Start battle. Let's do this. Oh, God. All right. How do we move? All right. That's good. Okay. We figure out how we turn. We know Trident. I'm assuming it plays very similar to... Look how far we spawn back on PC. Thank God. None of this getting spotted 30 seconds into the match bullshit. Let's go. Action stations. Oh boy. This is gonna be fun. First match back on PC. Let's see what I can get a hold of. What is our range? Like That's something that I, I honestly have no idea. Okay, so shift is how we look down sights, and it appears that our range, it doesn't even tell you what your range is that you're looking at? No, it doesn't. Okay, good to know. Okay, destroyer spotted already. Let's go ahead and cross in front of this island. We're gonna, you guys know I like to hold the edges. We got a target. He's out of our range. He's currently at 23 kilometers. Look at that. AA just going off over there. Now you guys will have to forgive me just a little bit. It's going to take me a little while to figure out how to shoot in this game properly. I'm definitely not a marksman. Not even a marksman on World of Warships console. All right, let's go. All right, almost within 21 kilometers. Oh, we got our first target. What are we looking at? It doesn't tell us. Okay. Well, let's just give a normal lead. Uh, he's changing course. Give him the full beans! Oh no! Wait, what? Why? No, we want AP. Why do we have HE loaded? Two. God darn it. Okay, we definitely overled him, by the way. But it's very similar. Wow. Even on freaking PC, they screw you by. Alright, let's look around. I gotta pay attention to what's going on elsewhere, too. This 
guy double him back. Okay, we got a destroyer in Charlie. He's in his smoke. Now, if I remember, oh yes. We don't have a shot at him. God, I wish this was a thing in PC or on console to be able to like activate a freaking plane and then be able to look higher. Uh, I don't know what the range is on these torpedoes on PC, so we're just gonna assume that they can hit us. Let's see if we can't help. Oh, he's reversing. Torpedoes, direct front. He's reversing. Torpedoes, direct front. God, the gun sounds great, though. Not gonna lie. Dude, don't do it. And down he goes. God darn it. Haven't even got to shoot anything. We've already lost a guy on our side. On fire. Can we focus? Give a test shot. That's a little too much lead. Aim higher, see if he turns out. Spotter returning to ship. Too high. Okay. Go ahead and press the T key, get some heal, heals back. Enemy oh, we got one hit. All right, let's turn back. We're about to run into the edge of the map. Let's turn all the way back, get our guns focused on the other side. Is that battleship shooting HE at us, or is that just cruiser and destroyer HE doing that much damage? Also, when do these fires burn out? Okay, apparently right now. All right. The ship is on fire. Definitely got to get our, our sights back to normal here. I think we're less likely to be put in or set on fire at the moment. Oh! First Citadel, baby! Give him the front guns. Oh, it looks good. Look how accurate that is. Good lord. Problem solved, sir. Yeah! Mm. We here out here doing things, boys. We are out here doing things. Let's do it. Oh, you're in trouble. All right, he's definitely going faster than that guy. So we want to aim a little. Ah, oh, he's angling away. All right, who else we got? We got this cruiser out here. He's angling away. Uh, let's go something like that. God, I will figure out what I need to do to lead people. Oh my god, that looks good. That looks good! Get him! Oh yeah, I love this Enemy game already. Oh my god, this is Citadel City. Just give me all the... If once I get my aim down, these people are screwed. These people are so screwed. I think he's stopping. 
I think he's actually stopping. That man is goaded. Are we going to hit somebody else? No, probably not because these guys are too far forward. We still got him with one overpin for like 3,600. Or no, that was a full pin. All right, let's take a look at this battleship here. God, this game is so good. Slightly overled him a little bit, not gonna lie. So we want to bring that in a little bit. Give him something like this. Oh my god. Get him! Come on! Get him! Oof. Alright. We got a couple over pins, couple of pins. Dude, I'm loving this so far. I know we're losing by points. Or at least losing by caps, so we gotta make something happen here. But uh, we are absolutely punishing these guys. Give him another full salvo, boys! He wants to sail in a straight line broadside to me. Let's see what happens. Ooh! That'll be the one. That'll be the one. Down goes another battleship. I told you, once we get our aim on... Once we get to figure out how far we got to actually lead things, these guys are in a lot of trouble. Okay, this guy's kind of turning in. He's slowing down. Let's not take the bait. Detected. Goodbye, sunshine. Go back to port. Oh, we left him. We actually freaking got like nothing out of that. We hit his torpedo protection. Interesting. All right, we got a we got a battleship shooting at us. Time to uh, get our shit together. Oof, we just took a nasty hit there. Hello, let's go ahead and get some of that heal back. Uh, let's see, he's barely creeping. Let's go ahead and give him front guns. Not the best hit ever. Alright. Apparently we don't have quite the armor that I thought we had. Because he is tearing us up. There we go. That's a better hit. How much longer are we burning? Let's just go ahead and put that out. We do have two more heals to utilize. Okay, he's behind an island, so we can't really do anything there. We do have two destroyers out here running around. Problem solved, sir. One of them all the way out here to our right. He's, uh, he's harassing our carrier. He's not really a threat to me at the moment. I can't lob the island, and this guy looks like he's about to go down. Looks like our guy's in trouble, though, from this destroyer. And I don't think I can actually help him. Uh, why? Maybe? Spotter airborne. Yeah. That sucks. He got rid of their battleship. Let's go ahead and uh, use that heal. Get. Switching to our freaking HE. Got a battleship grabbing Charlie. We've already grabbed Al Alpha. Fire. 
What are you doing, sunshine? You gonna make a move? You gonna make a move? Looks like you're making a move! Probably gonna regret this in the near future. Come on, baby. Where are you at? I thought you wanted the tango. Ah, there you are. Problem solved, I got sir. you. I respect it. Nice kill. All right. Beautiful. Love to see it. Beautiful. All right. Give me something to shoot at, boys. I think for our first game back in World of Warships, I think we're doing okay. We're going to be able to capture this base. Beautiful. Look at that. Solo cap and everything. We now control all the points, and it's just waiting for this guy to die or uh, get into the game. So, GG's. Our victory is in sight. Now, a lot of the sounds, a lot of the game, it, it feels right. But uh, I definitely got to get used to aiming with a with a freaking mouse and keyboard and uh, sailing around. The sailing part with the keyboard's not too bad. Got to learn all the keys and stuff. But uh, yeah. Definitely, definitely something I need to learn and get better with, for sure. Now, obviously, we're still detected, so we're waiting for a, our opportunity. He just went undetected. Okay. I don't know if he went behind a smoke or if he just got out of our detection range, but... Kind of waiting for this destroyer to track him down. Okay, we got Torps sent at our other battleship. The one downside is I wish it kind of told us what the, uh, what the ship that we're looking at is. Like, is there, somebody's gonna have to let me know down in the comments below, uh, if that's a thing on PC. Because not being able to see what that ship is or what I'm looking at in terms of shooting at, is kind of a big deal. I need to know how much armor I'm up against and, and stuff like that. Like... Okay, so we got free look. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and change course here. Oh, there he is! Oh, I nailed him. I freaking... Oh my god, they splashed short. They actually splashed short. That's so, so annoying. That looked like it was so good. So we know we need a roughly that lead. He's kind of coming towards us. And he disappears. He turned out, which we already played for. There we go. Big hit. And he should be dead any moment. There it is. Beautiful. Beautiful. Love to see it. Alright, so... Our first game back in World of Warships PC. 
90,000 damage. Let's look at the team score, shall we? Second on the team, baby. Out here representing console well, I think. Out here showing pretty well, I think. Let me know what you guys think. Do you want to see more World of Warships PC action? Do you want to see more content from the World of Warships PC? Let me know. And if you like what I'm doing, punch the like button. Leave a comment below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Alright.